and we're back from where Gatsby and we're just gonna, you know, continue the story here. Gatsby is dead now. Gatsby's bedroom looking for answers and his father has come here and yeah. Okay, we earned 19,500 points and we have 280,000 points at the moment and the secret word was passed. Ooh, one of these again, okay. Uh, fellow bootlegger. That is totally... Wolfsheim. Gatsby's mentor. Uh, a murderer now dead. There we go incited someone to kill. That's Tom Buchanan. Gatsby's father, a farmer. Gatsby's mentor. He talked about him, but I don't remember his name. Dan, maybe? Dan Scott or something? I don't know. A sparsely attended funeral. Oh yeah, they fixed the funeral. It was basically just Tom. Or no, um, Nick that showed up. Where's the cat again? Kind of. Delay? I don't know what letter I'm looking for. Oh well, I mean Gatsby's father is here too, obviously. Oh yeah, and the, oh, the Owl Man! Owl Eyes is here too! Owl Eyes, my favorite character in the whole book. I'm so glad they have him in the game. Even if he isn't here a lot, but I gl I'm glad they have him in the game overall. I'm so happy about that. Definitely my favorite character in the novel. Kitty cat! I couldn't get to the house. Neither could anybody else. Go on. Why, my God. They used to go there by the hundreds. The poor son of a bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't think he would say it like that. <laughs> Eyeglass is an apple. There. Um, but I want my last letter first. 
But yeah, Owlice is um is a mysterious character. He's never explained. He's just there and he just knows things. I just realized there's a jumping frog here. He just just there and just knows things. I guess delay. No. Oh, what is it then? Yeah, I thought the lay was weird. Um, DK? I guess DK is better than delay. It has to do with death. So f oh, yes, it is DK. There we go. So the first time I was wrong. Here we go. We earned 83,750 points and we have 368,750 points at the moment and the secret word was indeed DK. death the east was haunted for me so when the blue smoke of brittle leaves was in the air I decided to come back home there was one thing to be done before I left an awkward unpleasant thing that perhaps had better have been let alone I saw Jordan Baker and talked over and around what had happened to us together and what had happened afterward to me and she lay perfectly still listening in a big chair she was dressed to play golf and I remember thinking she looked like a good illustration her chin raised a little, jauntily, her hair the color of an autumn leaf, her face the same brown tint as the fingerless glove on her knee. When I had finished, she told me without comment that she was engaged to another man. For just a minute I wondered if I wasn't making a mistake. Then I thought it all over again quickly and got up to say goodbye. Yes, yeah, so in the book, um, Jordan is, is a professional golf player. There is a rumor, I think, about that she cheats, but... You don't really know about that, but she is, um, she, like, you get the impression that she's a bit of a, I guess, a rule bender-ish. Um, she drives very fast, apparently, according to the book. Um, and there, there's always this thing in the book where it's kind of something between Nick and Jordan, but it's not, but it's kind of-ish. But I don't think Jordan would ever, like, ever cared that much, and, uh, yeah, I think Daisy tries to get them together, Jordan and Nick too, because she likes them and blah blah, but, yeah. Yeah. Uh, a Manhattan restaurant, a confrontation. Oh yeah, okay, I, I think that might be Nick, actually. Uh, let's see, where's my book? There it is. Careless, I think it says there. Yeah, I'd say Jordan actually is probably could probably be called careless. She's definitely in the whole rich-ish life thing. Tom and Daisy. Although I guess she's a little more in between Nick and Tom and Daisy. Hmm. Uh, one letter left as usual. Oh, it's actually up there. Woohoo! There is a whole yacht in here. Or maybe a picture of one, but... You know. Mm, or a miniature one. <laughs> I don't know.
I did tell him, Nick. That fellow had it coming to him. He threw dust into your eyes just like he did in Daisy's. But he was a tough one. He ran over Myrtle like you'd run over a dog and never even stopped his car. There is nothing I could say except the one unutterable fact that it wasn't true. I couldn't forgive him or like him, but I saw that what he had done was, to him, entirely justified. They were careless people, Tom and Daisy. They smashed up things and creatures and then retreated back into their money or their vast carelessness or whatever it was that kept them together and let other people clean up. I don't know, I like that part when Nick describes them like that. Hmm. <clears throat> Where's this music? There it is. Souffle and Jockey. We earned 26,500 points, we have 437,250 points, the secret word was careless, and we have another trophy. The end of the Secret word was longing. Find a green light. Okay. As One. I sat there brooding on the old, unknown world, I thought of Gatsby's wonder when he first picked out the green light at the end of Daisy's dock. Gatsby believed in the green light, the orgastic future that year by year recedes before us. It eluded us then, but that's no matter. Tomorrow we will run faster, stretch out our arms farther, and one fine morning, so we beat on, boats against the current, borne back ceaselessly into the past. And that was that! That was the entire game! Thank you for playing! We hope you enjoyed Classic Adventures The Great Gatsby. If you'd like to play again, create a new profile. Uh, hidden object this will be randomized. You might like to find all library books and secret words. Uh, yeah, so basically the only thing I don't have is, of course, all the books. And we should, of course, watch the credits. All the wonderful people who made this awesome game. <gasps> Look at these cool credits, though. <laughs> oh yeah, what were they called? I game or something like that, I think. Hmm.
programming lead. Wee. Programming team. Oh, two people. <laughs> they were three people on programming. All right, art director. Yeah, the art is amazing too. Art lead. Oh yeah, they had a lot of artists probably. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. Yeah, I can see that. Ooh, video and particle effects. Some QA people. <laughs> More QA people. Deployment manager. Hmm. Okay, deployment. Publishing. Is there any music here? Oh, there's just background noises of like cicadas and water. Ah, cool. Oh, Nancy Kiss. All oh, the voice actors! Yay! Those awesome voice actors. The voice acting was, was good. The voice acting was good. Post beta game balancing support. <laughs> There's so many people though, like, like around making a game. There's not just the people making the actual game. There's so many people around to make it work. Testers and marketing people and QA and all these people. Team inspiration. Aw. Text selections for the Grace Gatsby by F. Scott Fitzgerald. Copyright. Copyright renewed. Produced by permission. Oh, they got, yeah, I guess they have to get all the permissions. Huh. Music courtesy of stockmusicsite.com. <gasps> we have the credits trophy now. It's not. Oh, it is. It's totally starting again. <laughs> Ever, so bye bye.